All right, it's Mikey Pipes again. We're going on a service call. Right now we're in the harbor, Hewlett Harbor. And we are going to a job. Oh, look, just stop sign. STOP. I'm getting it, I'm learning, Stephen. I'm learning. We're going to this job where, you know, the washing machine was making noise um, over the weekend. And, you know, so the customer calls up. And I was like, well, like, if you think it's not the washing machine, you know, go look at the water meter. And the water meter, the minute hand was just slowly turning. This is the little minute, you know, little second thing was slowly turning. And I was like, man, it sounds like it's something wrong with your washing machine. You know, the clothes washer, right? So apparently the appliance doctor, <gasps> the appliance doctor, was there today and basically scared the shit out of her and said that she has a massive plumbing problem and she's going to have mold, mildew, and all that other good stuff. So it looks like my, I may have to place a call to my uh, my friend, my public adjuster guy, and uh, maybe get her hooked up with an insurance claim. We'll see. It depends on the damage, but, you know, you never know. So you got some, this is the harbor. I got these nice houses here. I'm gonna show you one coming up right here right at this next yield sign. By the way, this guy over here, I've always told he owns best yet markets. Look at this, look at that. Gangsta, wow. All right, so, ooh, another stop sign, we're good. All right, I'll take some footage, see what's going on here. Stay tuned. Oh, all right. We have a second floor. Laundry room, right? Mm -hmm. And what a laundry sink. And you hear that, guys? It sounds like water is going into the standpipe here. And water is going into the standpipe there. You want to know how I know? <laughs> because I am the licensed master plumber. Oh. Right, and I know things. I know that these are not burst free washing machine hoses, right? And hopefully they were changed when this washing machine was put in, right? So I know that. Mm -hmm. I know that the number one cause of water damage claims in residential structures mm -hmm. are burst washing machine hoses. Mm -hmm. Do you know what the number two insurance claim is for water damage? Uh, burst pipes? Uh, Close. Damn. What kind of pipe, though? No, the number two uh -huh. pi um, water claim cause for residential structures are those plastic ice maker tubing. Really? Yeah, the plastic ones. Oh. Those things leak like... What do you have? Copper. You have copper? Remember we ran it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So anyway, I know if my all my different types of ice... My wet ice, wet gourmet ice. And these are water hammer arresters. So, you know, when the quickly closing valve on the machine, you know, closes, uh, it doesn't bang and cause a water hammer. But you hear that noise? All right. We have a trap primer right here. See that? Right there. Half inch trap primer. And its job is to fill the trap with water so it doesn't dry out. So I am gonna make, and you can actually see the water running. See it in there? Right there. So what sucks is if I close this, right? Now she doesn't have any hot, cold water. So maybe, maybe, just maybe we can adjust this, all right? It's filling the floor trap, which I'm sure there's a floor drain here. Maybe it's under the machine, but that's the cause right there. Not really a big issue. Not gonna have mold or mildew, but honestly, I haven't seen one of those in quite some time. So I'm gonna have to do some research on this, right? Cause I'm not gonna start taking this apart and what have you, but I'm gonna take a picture of this and then I'm going to uh, reach out to uh, some of my colleagues and see what the deal is with this, right? Because it looks like it's made by Watts. Let's see if I can get in there. Yep. So to all my plumbing guys out there, you see that right there? Let me get your feedback on this. What's the repair of this? 
I really don't want to open up this lady's wall because it's nice. You have a nice little access compartment there. Maybe I could just like rebuild that thing in place. So there you have it.